Barnali Shukla, the writer and director of the film, she had come to meet Shefali and narrate this script. Uh, so after she went, I asked Shefali what was the film about and she narrated me the basic plot of the film. And I said, so who is producing it? And she said, so far nobody, she's searching for a producer. So I said, ask her if she wants me to produce it, I'm happy to produce. We went through a couple of names and then we finally felt that, you know, Rahul was best choice for Aga. So that's how we thought of, you know, getting Rahul to do the role. He went through the narration and then he accepted it. So that's how we got him. See, honestly, uh, you know, when I speak about Shefali, it's a, it's a bit of a dilemma for me because Generally, people think, oh, he's, she is his wife, so he's going to only say good things about her. But she is uh, one of the best actresses that we have. Anyway, it was not my choice. Barnali and Shefali had already decided to work on the film. I was the one who was entering into the film. So, uh, I did not have a choice there. I had to go with the choice of the writer-director. I mean, whether it is Vakt or whether it is Satya or whether it is Gandhi, my father or last year, uh, you cannot connect the two people as one. And I think that's her biggest strength as an actor. And that comes because she behaves like the character. I don't think we ever thought of Akshay to begin with and I don't think it would have been right for me to go and ask Akshay to uh, work for a film like this. I think he works in a very different space and uh, I'm not challenging him as an actor. I'm sure he would have done uh, a fantastic job as an actor. Bernali's strongest point is that she doesn't talk. She won't tell you anything when you ask her anything. So sometimes when she says something, I don't react to them. And I say, okay, let me think about it because she said something which I am not able to follow. She has a very clear thought on what cinema she wants to be. After the edit, I was the one who wanted to reshoot certain parts and do it, make them better. And Bernali kept saying no and I kept saying no, take more days, shoot. So I think um, we made it in a very nice spirit and that's the best part about the film. It's a journey of one housewife who's on a rebel and if she decides to break free, what happens? So I feel it's for youth, it's for females and males have no choice if their wives want to drag them to see the film. So we poor males are going to go with our wives and see it.